My YouTube video starts here. <laughs> <laughs> well, the English experience the English, tonight. Yes, the Ollie and Shovels are just checking into their accommodation. I've got them home. I've got them here safe from the airport. And I might take them for a wee pint of Guinness. Oh, really? Ah, uh, yawning. There you go. <laughs> it's it's currently 14 degrees. Uh, we're queuing up to get into the ploughing. Yeah, Sammy's got hair extensions. Do you want to lend them, Shovels? I could do something. I could do a little something. Uh, it's 10 a.m. It promised 23 degrees. It's foggy. I'm in sh tiny shorts. Very tiny. Daisy, <laughs> Daisy Duke wouldn't even wear these. <laughs> so I'm going to be freezing my ass off all day. I don't. This is the queue anyway at the minute. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you dressed like a schoolboy in a blazer and shorts? <laughs> Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah. Do I look like a school It's Hermione. <laughs> Hermione, lucky That's, that's your blended like in look. I'm not a school boy. <laughs> <laughs> Shovels, hat on or hat off? I think hat on looks alright. Yeah. Yeah? Look like a drifter. A drifter? Yeah. <laughs> a drifter, school boy. Yeah, school boy drifter. A school boy drifter, that's yeah. the look we're going for. That's Irish for school boy school drifter. Boy drifter. <laughs> we have parked by the field, the stubble field with all the cars. Just remember that, lads, okay? Right, our first stop is Grassman, Mr. Ollie Blogs, isn't it? It's what? Grassman. Yeah, we're just going to see if we can and find And of course it's jammed. Well, well, how he is. Well, yeah, what's photo. crack? Yeah. Photo. Yeah. Of course, yeah. Second stop on the tour is KBT. Hi. Hey. Actually, KBT tires are the guys who give me my wristband. Thank you, KBT. And Ollie is making an appearance here at 11 a.m. Are you nervous, Kevin? Uh, no, you're <laughs> Kevin, I've told Kevin what? that we're going to do a wee video on the, his tyres and he's uh, doing his research oh, there. But <laughs> no, I'm only joking. You know everything, don't you? I do. I know everything. Right, so you were mad to show me that tyre beside you there because of the ridge in it or whatever yeah. it is. Right, explain it to me there now. So this is the latest uh, Alliance AgriStar 2 tyre, right? Yes. It's excellent wear and excellent value for money. It has a two strategy layer. When the tyre wears down 40%, when it wears down to this, the tyre starts to change direction mm -hmm. and it has to improve grip and road handling. It has excellent anti-skid properties. It has extra wear and low noise due to its central mass of rubber here on the tyre. Alliance Tyre, who are owned by Yokohama, made yep. in India with Japanese technology. Oh, yeah. that's, a, that's a lot of around the world. Okay. The world. This is a new one over here, Kevin. What's this now? This is a uh, Alliance uh, AgriFlex 372. AgriFlex. AgriFlex. Yeah. So is that behind you there? Ta AgriFlex tire technology. Tire technology. It's cool. the latest technology. It's got a steel belted top layer. Okay. This tire can can work at 40 percent less pressure than a normal tire. Mm-hmm. Or it can carry 40% more load at the same pressure. Okay. This tire can work down as low as six pounds per pressure, six pounds up to a, a pressure of 38 pounds. I only wish I knew what you were talking about there, but I'm sure everyone watching will know. Will you feck off waving in the background? <laughs> cool, this is okay. one of the steel belted tires available in the- We can't hear you, how long? In the, oh, all right. You take that. Yeah, so this is one of the only steel belted tires available in VF technology in the market. So it has got a stubble guard compound, puncture proof uh, technology in that. Yeah. No, thanks, Kevin. Thanks, that wasn't too painful, was no, it? <laughs> Are you tempted, Ollie? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Coffee that coffee good. smells good. Oh. That's a one. Hopefully, Charlotte can see that. This is what he's eating for breakfast, Charlotte. <laughs> All over your mouth. What are you eating, shovels? Caramel bread. You just let them away for oh a day and they just go nuts. We're here at the Malone stand and Simon had his hair done especially for the show. <laughs> With fluffy sun cream. It's a similar, similar that's, colour that's at all. Genuine minge. <laughs> this is for YouTube, Holly. <laughs> uh, how's it been going this week? It's been flower busy. Yeah. It's too warm though. Oh, stop. You're always complaining. I'm always complaining. What was the highlight of the three days, Simon? Apart from seeing highlight? me and Ollie. Three, three days. And shovels. Three days. Highlight? Well, a highlight was seeing you, obviously. Right, second highlight. 
Um, the, bar, the bar. A highlight of my drinking career this this trip was tea. Tea. Well, you can see your, right, your, let's your talk bun. to someone more interested. You can see <laughs> it. Well, grab that there. Oh, How are you, young chap? I'm nice now. Yeah. And yourself? What's your grand? Are you enjoying yourself over the three ah, years? Ah, yeah, sure. Here now, you have the whole day lit up for me. Now, <laughs> you're, you're, this is your turn now to give out about it's too hot. No, it's absolutely perfect. All right. Yeah, you're yeah. happy enough with the heat. I'm happy now. It's just lovely. It's great. Everybody's in good old form, Sammy. And um, was um, Malone busy? Yeah, we're very busy there uh, the last um, last two days now. So, um, yeah, we've a couple of new products. Sorry, I have to remember my job, Sammy. Oh, yeah. We're new, launching a new rake there to, uh, at the Plowing here. So, lovely. yeah, good interest in it, yeah. So. And do you know all the spec now? Oh, uh, who won the competition in Germany, Sammy? Oh, you did actually yeah. win the competition in Germany. <laughs> Yeah, Fergal knows his stuff. You can't catch this man. I don't. I don't forget. Um, <laughs> highlight of the three days, Fergal. Um, highlight of the three days. Uh, well, of course yourself today. Now ah, this. Ah, go for the safe option. Uh, look at. Uh, I suppose uh, people came along. They're in good form. Everybody's happy. They're interested in the machines. You know, everything looks good. Everything good and positive. So, yeah. But we're, you're delighted we're, it's over. I won't say I won't deny that bit now. Yeah, yeah, it's hard going, but look at it's worth it at the end of the day. So back to Mayo with you now at five back, o'clock. Back to <laughs> Barry. <laughs> Just bumped into Justin McCarthy who won a Massey, what was it? Massey 3085 and the Class Square Baylor. Yeah. It's about a year yeah. ago, wasn't about it? A year ago, yeah. And, yeah. and have you put it to work at all? Well, the Baylor anyway, I traded in the tractor and bought another one. So. Oh, you're not into Masseys, no? No. no what no, what no. did you get instead? I bought a case. A case? Oh, yeah. well, you kept with red. Exactly, exactly. Uh, are you having a good time? Yeah, brilliant, brilliant. Who have That's we got fine. here? This is Aiden. How are you, Aiden? This is his first ploughing. First ploughing, first of many, Aiden. Yeah. Well, enjoy your day, lads. Thanks, so Shovels is getting a kitted out with a, a brand new jacket, 3XL slim fit, <laughs> and I've, I've had to go for an age 11 to 12 child's one, <laughs> but we're all happy out, thanks well, Simon. perfect for the childish. Yeah, yeah the big childish head, schoolboy yeah. look, to continue with the schoolboy look. Oh, yeah. uh, right lads, good luck. Uh, one second just me. wave, I'm not, just wave, just wave Fergal. <laughs> That, that was Irish for feck off. Are you having a good day so far, lads? So what? You definitely look like a dad, you know, with the wee school uh, bag on school and, bag. and carrying yeah, the water. Yes, they should definitely put a, a tua on the end of that. They're, they're missing a trick there. What's that, Ollie? It's a, it's a chopper. Is a it? chopper. It's pretty good. Massy, but not a green one. <laughs> Why? Huh? You could raffle that. I don't think finished. anyone would want a green Massy, Ollie. I think a lot of people will pay a big money for that. I don't think so. So now we are off to see the Tumbling Paddies, and the lads are delighted, aren't you, Ollie? Yeah. Very excited to go see them. Yeah. Yeah. Hold <laughs> on, Ollie has now spotted a yellow John Deere. So now we're going to be about another 20 minutes while he looks at the yellow John Deere. The lads just keep getting lost. Come on! To go see the Tomlin Paddy. Yay, we made it. Doing a Luke Combs cover. Oh, but we can't get in anywhere near them. They're in there. Shovels is loving it now, the Eagles is on. Yeah. <laughs> great dancing, Ollie, great dancing. <laughs>
we're on the Merlot stand. And over there there's a 307. 307. No, it's a mini Merlot, so we've got a mini Merlot and we've got another one coming. Okay. And uh, Sean works in Merlot and he's going to tell you about it. Hey, Sean. Smashing. So, this is the P276 Plus, so 2.7 tonne, 6 metre, dead easy on a Merlot. The numbers relate to the capacity. Probably one of our best selling machines in the UK and Ireland. Great compact machine, only 1.8 metres wide. Really able, nimble machine. What would I use this for now, Sean? Well, generally around a yard, you'll find this machine shifting, loading, mix, loading the mixer, putting in stuff into the bedder. Great all-purpose machine. It's the machine that you jump on and go to. Dead easy to get in and out of. Show me your pride and joy here on the, the stand. Well, really, Apart from yourself now. The, the attention <laughs> grabber has got to be the 30 metre roto that's oh, over Oh, wow. Here. The 5030S Plus. It's not our range topper, we go a bit bigger, but at 30 metres, it's catching everyone's attention on the show. It can be seen from all over the show. Really, the roto stands apart from the crowd. How much would one of them set me back now, so, Sean? Just 350,000 euros out of the book. Is that so, all, yeah? That's it. Plus the VAT, of course. She'll take 349, will you? Oh, well, <laughs> it's a deal to be had, Sammy. Are you enjoying the ploughing so far, Sean? It's fantastic show, great weather, of course, that's helped. Oh, it's always like this in Ireland. Of course. <laughs> I believe you. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> it's the first day's article. The first day since 1987, it's been sunny. And what's the plan now after today, Sean? Because you pack up, don't you? We pack up. We straight back to the UK because this week it's also the APF Forestry Show over at Ragley. Oh yes, that's so, where Ollie's going. Where are you based in the UK? So we're way down in the south, we're just outside Southampton in the new forest at Ringwood. Cool Sean, but well, thanks for making the trip over to Ireland. Love it, always pleased to come to Ireland. Yeah, yeah, because we're great aren't we? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? Now that is what I need there, I'd love one of them. Under my hat, it's only about 100 degrees now. <laughs> it's like a pressure cooker. Yeah. My egg is boiled. <laughs> oh, jolly in the background yeah. with his wee hat on as well. Yeah. Shovels is wondering why McKeever has a queue outside it. If you go to O'Neill's as well, there'd be a big queue outside it. And what I don't understand is there's a big queue outside Lidl. Like there's about three Lidl's in every town, yet there's a big queue outside it here. Anyway, the Irish. We're funny old people. You are funny, but you like your ice creams because we haven't found one without a queue. Is that one got a queue? Yeah. Hungry or anything before we head home? We can get something at the airport, can't we? You can get something at the, the airport, yeah. Do you want ice cream? Do you want ice cream? Oh, look at that. <laughs> He's like a big kid. What? 330. Jesus Christ. We're like three big kids now, all delighted with our ice cream. Happy out. So we had to visit Grassmen before we left. Where's our wee Kirsty? Give us a wave, Kirsty! This is the mode of transport to get in and out of the ploughing. Um, everyone just bails into that trailer. On the back of a nice New Holland T6070. Right, so it's the end of the day, Ollie. Yep. What uh, is your thoughts about the Irish Ploughing Championships? I've never seen so many people other than in Euston <laughs> Station. Yeah, it was jammed. Where the trains are jammed up. Um, no, it's brilliant. The sun was amazing, although I didn't have a hat or glasses despite having two in your car, but it was too far to come back. Everyone was so friendly. It, yeah, it was brilliant. I've never seen dust at a show either, and there was uh -huh. dust. It's always like that in Ireland, the weather's yeah, usually yeah. that nice. Yeah. yeah, no, it was a really good day. Um, um, I reckon we've seen 10% of it though. Yeah, probably only 10%. Highlight yeah. of the day? Um, Ooh, is this on YouTube, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just can't say Kirsty then. <laughs> <laughs> you can say Kirsty. <laughs> I don't know, I just, just see, I, I like machines, don't I? So that, that Merlot was massive. Yeah, the 30, 30 metre yeah, high one. Yeah. yeah, it was pretty cool. What's your highlight of the day, Shovels? I know it's a bit cliche, my highlights are people. The, the show's people. a show. He means Kirsty yeah, as well. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you all, you all live within an hour of the show because two hours is too far, but it seems to be in Ireland. Yeah. But yeah, loads of lovely, friendly people. That's fab. You got some, you got some better accents than we have, to be fair. Thanks for coming along. Thanks for driving. Uh, Thanks to Malone as well for giving us the hats. Oh, yeah. yes. And the uh, coach. And the coach. And the coach, yeah. Thanks, Malone. Um, right, so I have to get these lads to the airport. They have to be at the airport, and uh, I've told them it's only an hour away, but it's probably more like two hours away. Yeah. <laughs> but sure, I'm a fast pilot. I'm a good driver. She's going to drive it like she stowed it on the way back. Yeah. <laughs> Which is what she did on the way. Yeah. Uh, and enjoy. What show are you going to tomorrow? 
uh, the APF. APF show in Ragley in Worcestershire. Okay, so if you want to see the lads in the UK, they're going to be at that show that they just mentioned. <laughs> thanks, APF. For, thanks for watching. Do you watching. your teeth? Uh, yeah. Are they turkey teeth? No, they're no, they're my own. They come, sure? own. they come out of my own head. Really? Yeah. Wow. Um, and don't forget to chicken teeth, turkey teeth. No, thank don't, you for watching like my YouTube. Oh right. yes, of course. Yeah. yeah. Oh, watch yeah. Me Thanks instead. for watching, Sammy. Yeah, despite her hat on backwards. Yeah, keep up with the YouTube. Like and subscribe. <laughs> See you later. Thanks, lad.